Hey guys, Newman here today. You are looking at my favorite Star Wars figures. Um, we're gonna start from this side to that side. I have tons more, but these are my favorite. I know it looks like a lot, but they're all my favorite. Can't choose between them. This one is a very old, it's a custom snake eyes. I put a backpack on them. This is Captain Rex's body. I put snake eyes' his helmet. helmet. It looks really nice. And, yeah, and I put a little Black Series Ewok set. And that's one of their, like, man purses. Second one, Commander Cody, Clone Wars. Look at this. That's not his um, head. I chose, I just put the head that looks a lot like him. Okay, last year during school in grade 5. I'm doing 6 now, so this was last year. In the winter. I was gone in PEI to see my dad. Then I remember to myself, oh crap, I, I, I forgot my Star Wars figures in my desk. Not, yeah, no, it wasn't in the winter. It was when my classes split. My classes split. And my Star Wars figures were left in my desk. So, I went back to into that. So, I went to the class that was split. So, there's two classes that split. I wasn't with the original class. I went to a different class. So I had to clear out my desk and I was like, oh my god. My Star Wars figure's there, but where's his head? And where's Chewbacca? Chewbacca's gone. I brought one more figure. He's not one of my favorites though. <laughs> and his head and his helmet wasn't there. So my friend Steven, he comes over. Or I think it was Steven. I don't know, I forget who it was. One of my good friends though. Handed me a helmet because it was on my shirt, my um, teacher's desk. I was like, um, yeah, uh, it's same with Chewbacca. Um, where, where's his head? I asked. It's like I don't know. A kid was swooping in your desk because he was in his desk because he sat right behind him, my friend. And I was like, oh my god, that's no Star Wars figures, right? So I'm not gonna call the kid out, but I know who he is. And, I mean, I, I don't know if it's true or not. That's just one one of my friends said last year. So, yeah, he has a wobbly head from now on. Yeah, so he's just a phase two Commander Cody figure. One of my favorites. Yeah, I love this figure. It's a uh, black series. Um, three and three quarter inch. Looks, um, Hoth, Luke Skywalker. It's really nice. Really like this figure. Very articulated. And here's the Chewbacca I was talking about. He was on the desk. Nothing was wrong with Chewbacca, though. Nothing was wrong with Chewbacca. But the, I like Chewbacca. He's just he's detailed and articulation on him. And he's a... Uh, he's supposed to be Sam's scale. That is him. It's just Chewbacca's bigger. So they actually made a big... That's what I love about him. Um... Yeah. This is not my figure. It's Brandon's figure, but he doesn't even play around with those anymore. But I do love myself. Uh, this is my favorite 5P away figure, though. Yes, it's 5P away. Who cares? He's just there for display. I like his painting. His painting's really nice. The shine off him's awesome. He yellowed, he yellowed on the tush a bit. <laughs> but uh, overall, except let the no articulation, really nice figure. I don't really like this, I'll be honest. My general groups don't really like it. But he was one of my very first figures. I'm pretty sure my first figure was um, Commander Wolf. I'm not sure. But this is one of my first. I, it could be my first. But I love him. I even remember Day getting him. He's just an overall nice figure. The thing I don't like about him is he doesn't have four arms. But it's okay, he's just there in the display. And I can't believe I still have this. Like it's unbelievable. It's a nice figure. Really nice figure. General Grievous. Now we're getting into the big stuff. Oh yeah, instead of yellowing, he pinked. He literally, his side turned pinked. And his bottom of the legs turned lightly pink. Here, man. It's really right there, though. Well, um, yeah, on the sides, look. It's pink. You can tell. Right there. Right here. It's pink. So weird. Now we're getting to the big guys. Gen General. Um, Dark Vader. Got him last Christmas. 5 P away, but he's still really nice. 
can move his legs though. Yeah, I don't really care about that though. He he's detailed, really detailed. Same with his eyes. They made him really dark burgundy. Really nice there. From behind, he looks awesome. And he came with a lightsaber and all that. So really nice figure. Move his head, and you can move his arms, just like a five P O A would. Favorite figure of all time, but I obviously had to put him in. Black Series Commander Gree, Toys R Us exclusive. Toys R Us in America is closed down now. Well, not all of them, but, you know, the business did. And Kendo, we're still rolling. Yay. But I put this on him. Awesome figure. Just look at it. Only thing I don't like is his helmet. It's just, I, I think they messed up a bit. I mean, it made it, made it a bit more... Bit too plain on his visor, but in the back looks awesome. The painted is absolutely amazing. It's an awesome figure. Just the detail, Ooh. detail and articulation on this guy is just crazy. Oh, here's my favorite Star Wars stickers. Boom, boom. Star Wars is one of my favorite things. I'm not really into it anymore, so I just had to make a video. I, I just couldn't leave it behind. Um, Black Series 40th anniversary. Obi Wan Kenobi, really nice figure, really detailed, really articulated face, looks just like him, and a really nice figure. Really like his coat, little Jedi coat. I think that you could do. You spread him out, and he has a bag in the back, a side bag, and a belt. So they still added the back stuff. You can take off this, but it's a pain. In the yeah, so I'm not gonna do it. But yeah, guys. These are my very first guys that I'd take on trips, take with me anywhere. These are the guys I'm most in love with. So one more, just a little side look at them. It looks like he just broke his neck. Oh my God. Oh my, why'd you have to do that? It's maybe they fell out of my desk and he found them. Like, I don't know. There. One more look. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. I had fun making it. I had fun making all of the videos, but at this point it was pretty cool. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed the first Star Wars video in at least a couple months. Probably like four or five. So yeah, hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.